Hey there, it's Dusty Thunder again with another AITA story for you. And this one is, am I the astronaut for not wearing my dress properly at my sister's wedding? Thursday, I, 27 female, spent the day with one of my friends celebrating her birthday early since I couldn't go out with our group over the weekend due to my sister's wedding on Saturday. That was a lot of words. I feel like I nailed it. She had wanted to get a tattoo. I jinxed myself. She had wanted to get a tattoo, so I went with her to a place that does walk-ins. One of the artists had the afternoon open, so I got one done, and it covers most of my shoulder. Saturday, the tattoo was still red and a bit puffy. I got to the venue to get ready with everyone else. My sister didn't say anything about the tattoo, so I thought I was good to go. It's a wide strap dress, and the strap was irritating my skin, and I didn't want to risk staining the straps either. So first I tried to just lower it, but that was a little awkward moving my arm, so I wound up just taking my arm out of the strap completely. I tried tucking the strap into the dress, but that wasn't working well, so I just let it hang on the side. No one said anything before or during the ceremony. When it was time for pictures, my sister just gave me a look and asked if I was being serious about the dress and to wear it the right way. I explained I couldn't because of the tattoo, and she told me that wasn't her problem because I picked a terrible time to get a new tattoo if it interfered with how I was wearing the dress. I did put it right for pictures, but but it was uncomfortable as hell and pulled my arm back right out afterward. I didn't get to talk to my sister much during the reception, but she did throw a few dirty looks my way and her other bridesmaids and our aunt told me that I needed to just wear the dress properly for a few hours. This morning, I texted her to have fun on her honeymoon and never heard anything back, which is unusual for her. So I texted again, joking if she was already having too much fun to talk. She did respond, but only to tell me she was still a bit mad that I refused to just wear the dress right and walked around the whole wedding and reception looking trashy at a special family event in a nice place. Am I the asshole for not wearing the dress right? Obviously, you shouldn't have got it in the first place, OP. Like, what, are you, what are you thinking? You caused yourself pain and pissed somebody off in the process. Maybe thinking ahead about that and not doing this random thing. Like it wasn't a, it wasn't a symbolic tattoo. You just randomly did it with a friend. If it was something symbolic, everyone would probably have a little more sympathy for you, but it wasn't. It was random and it's just something you didn't think through. So yeah, I think you're the asshole for this, but where are you? Where are you in this universe of assholes? As a reminder, the Ascon scale, uh, Ascon 4 is the least amount of asshole. Ascon 1 is the worst or most amount of asshole. Least and most kind of just sounds wrong when using it with the word asshole, but here we are. So Ascon 4 is you could have done it differently. Ascon 3 is you should have done it differently. Not could have, but should have. Ascon 2 is you definitely shouldn't have done that. And Ascon 1 is you're a terrible human. I don't think we're in Ascon 1 territory here because it doesn't sound like it was a demonic thing to do. It's not evil. It was just a dumbass thing to do. And she definitely shouldn't have done it, which does land us in Ascon 2 territory, right? You do something that you know is going to be a problem because you know this wedding is happening. You know what the dress looks like. You know there's going to be a strap right where that tattoo is going. You're in Ascon 2 for it. Unless there's some kind of symbolism with it, but it doesn't sound like there was. But it also doesn't sound like it's a huge, huge, huge deal. You know what I mean? Like, sister's like, why the hell did you do this? Like, you suck. And she deserves every bit of the flack that she's getting right now, and probably more, but it sounds like the sister's actually not taking it terribly. She's not going no contact with her. She's just saying, yeah, I kind of hate you right now. And she deserves it. She probably just needs to take her licks here and move on. And if she values the relationship that she has with her sister, apologize and be like, yeah, that was a bonehead move. I'm really sorry. What can I do to make it up to you? I can try to learn Photoshop to fix it in the pictures because I'm guessing there were pictures during the ceremony and reception where she was wearing it the wrong way. Offer to fix it in whatever way you can try to move on from it or just accept that she's going to be pissed at you for a while and you deserve it and hope she forgives you someday. Luckily, I don't think this is so serious. It's going to leave a mark like a permanent one. Like a tattoo.